Have you just moved over to Linux from using Windows and decided that you still want to keep Google Chrome? Or you're a long time user of Linux and you've decided that you want to give Google Chrome a try? Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how to get Google Chrome installed on any Debian based system or any Linux system that accepts their packages and install it. And then once we're done, I'll show you how to uninstall it at the end. So let's get cracking. First thing, uh, first thing we need to do, as always, is give it a quick clear. Give it a. We need to update the system. So sudo apt update and and upgrade. Is part of the course before installing any software. Say yes to those four updates. Wait for them to come down. So as you can see here, these are my specs. These are my specs. There we go. That's what I'm currently running, and let's get in. Well, that'd help if I didn't do that. So the first thing we need to do is we need to download the Google Chrome Deb package. Now, you can't, well, you can get this from Google Chrome direct, well, Google correctly, but in my case, I'm just going to download the Deb package. So what we need to do, we need to tap wget https colon slash slash dl dot Google dot hello pl dot google dot com slash Linux slash direct slash Google Chrome stable underscore current underscore AMD sixty four so the sixty four bit systems dot deb and what we can see here, this will now go through the process of downloading the dev package. As we can see here, it is 88.67 megabytes. So this may vary, well, download sizes, but there we go. So after we have downloaded the dev package, we need to install the dev package. Now what's recommended if you're doing the, the dev package route like we are, is to do sudo apt install dot slash Google Chrome stable underscore current and then just hit tab. And this will now go through the process of being ready and prepared. And we now have a Google Chrome. It's going to take you to the first time setup process. In my case, I do not want to make you default and I will not let you send information you need to Google. And as we can see here, we have a function in Google Chrome. Now this is significantly faster than still in Chrome on Windows, for example. And you get, and you get to keep your stuff if you're logged in on Windows and you decide you want to use Linux, just log in here, you get all your stuff back. Anyway, this has been how to install Google Chrome on any uh, any Linux that supports dev packages. Have a wonderful rest of your day and have a happy new year.